Good morning guys, welcome back to a new cleaning video and happy Easter to each and every one of you guys. I hope you have a lovely day with your family and friends and your kids, um, whoever you spend the day with, I hope you have a good one. Um, so I'm really excited to be able to get a video up for you guys today. I was trying to debate whether I wanted to post today, but I thought it would be a treat for you guys. This video is a long one, so I hope that you grab some coffee, tea, um, grab a snack, whatever, or maybe you want to clean along with me in today's video. My name is Brandy. I like to po post cleaning motivation twice a week here on this channel. As of right now, I might be going up to a third day. I'm not sure yet, <laughs> but as of right now, I'm currently doing some cleaning also on my vlog channel, which is linked down below if you want to check that out. But, um, I'm having this dilemma right now as to what to do with that channel and the reason is is because i'm trying to solely focus on this one because it is performing better and doing better and i obviously don't want to take away vlogs because i love doing them and those were like one of my favorites to create at one time um so i don't really know i'd love to hear you guys feedback down below what do you guys think I should do with that I obviously like I said I still want to post over there but it's just getting to the point where um, I want to like work more on this so I don't know what to do but um, we're gonna start off in my kitchen my kitchen was completely trashed because we went to Costco and there was a lot of stuff that I needed to put away and then this was also toward the end of the week so you guys know that's been with me I like to do a cleaning routine Thursdays and Fridays so it was time to do a deep clean and wipe down all right so my little boy is here <laughs> of course um, I'm trying to get this video done for you guys today because I want to upload it before we have some family stuff going on later um, and I wasn't actually even going to do, like I said, do this video today, but I really wanted to because I noticed a lot of other YouTubers are not posting today because it's a holiday and I 100% agree with that. I hope everybody has a lovely day and they don't, they shouldn't have to sit around and worry about posting a YouTube video, but I just thought that it would be nice for maybe some of you guys that maybe have a couple hours of maybe not doing much and you want to maybe watch this video or you want to have a video to watch today because Sunday is normally my upload day. And I wanted to get it done for you guys. And I had some time. My husband is here, so it's not like I'm alone with Cole. And it's not like I'm taking time away uh, right now. He's being pretty good. <laughs> but you guys will probably hear him in the background because he's just running wild. He was so excited about the Easter basket today. Loved everything he got. Um, and we colored eggs last night, which I filmed in the vlog. And that video will be out on Tuesday over on the vlog channel. If For those of you that love watching, like... The vlogs and stuff um but yeah my sink was disgusting cole actually busted one of these popsicles so i needed to get those out of the sink and get this cleaned up but i'm just gonna pop in and out of this video a little bit i'm not gonna try to make this super rambly today guys i'm just gonna let you guys listen to some music and get your cleaning motivation on so i'm gonna be quiet now So I have had this pancake griddle 
for like 10 years. I'm not even crapping you guys. Also my baking pans as well. So I was finally able to get some new ones. After 10 years, I finally invested in them. I could have gotten them before, but guys, I was trying to use them as long as I could. But that griddle was so bad that it was burning all my food. So I had a coupon from Kohl's, which you guys know I hate Kohl's. Don't even know why I have a Kohl's card, but I do. <laughs> and I had a coupon, and then I also had like an extra $5 off for being like a loyal customer or something. So I was able to save a good amount I had like 30% plus the five, so 35% whatever, on the griddle and also my new baking pans, which I love. I tried them out and oh my God, it is like, they're so nice. Um, I'm gonna show them in a minute when I clean down under the bottom of my stove and I put them in there, but they're by the brand Food Network from Kohl's if you guys wanna check them out, but I do really like them. They're really nice and I had the woman that checked me out there tell me that they was really good, so I was super excited to hear that because I'm like, oh, if I'm spending you know, this amount, which I'm gonna be honest with you guys here on my channel. I'm always gonna be honest. I'm never gonna just like come on and try to hide anything or like not tell you guys the truth about products that I share on my channel, if that makes sense. I wanna be honest because that's just how I am as a person. But, um, so I pay, ended up paying $55 for the griddle and three new cookie uh, baking sheets or whatever. And they're really nice quality, I will say that. But it was a, I, it, the total price was like 80 some. And then by the time, well, by the time I ended up using my coupon, like I said, I only had to pay $55 and um yeah so anyways it, it to me it was worth it i love the color of the little griddle too it's just a bright fun um mint color i love it it's different and i haven't tried that one out yet so i'm excited to use it whenever we do pancakes or french toast or whatever but really excited about that so every week when i do a cleaning routine i like to wipe down all my appliances um especially if they're looking like they need it sometimes I'll skip it if they don't look that bad like the stainless steel part because sometimes I don't always get dirty it just depends but if I'm cooking over here on my stove and grease is going everywhere then it's normally bad <laughs> but I wanted to wipe down the front of my I try to always do this too because believe it or not they get so dirty so quick and I don't even know how but there's always a splatter of something so look at these old cookie pans that I've had for like 10 years I'm not even kidding you guys it was time for the investment so um, that one there is completely black. That is how old it was. And these pans were no longer non-stick. And then the muffin pan I'm going to keep because it wasn't that bad because I rarely ever use it. But this drawer was disgusting. But those pans were to the point to where they were no longer non-stick. So I always had to put parchment paper on them or foil. And they just, you guys, I'm just so happy that I was able to to get the new pans I'm very grateful because um, it was needed so um, I'm gonna show them to you guys here after I clean this drawer out but you guys um, will have to let me know were you hanging on to things for a really long time that you just haven't invested in like we honestly need a new toaster I've had it too for about 10 years and I got it from Walmart but it's getting to the point now where it's starting to burn things and it's it's just getting old, you know? <laughs> the numbers are wearing off of it. So that might be my next appliance investment is a new toaster for the kitchen. Um, but I just, these are just things that I slowly had to invest in because stuff is so expensive and I hate it. I hate how much it costs. And then I told my husband I really wanna do some like organization stuff in the kitchen. Um, of course, we got to save up for that because organization stuff's expensive too. But the best place that I've found to get that stuff is Ollie's. So I want to go there one day whenever I have the extra funds and maybe buy some stuff to organize the refrigerator. And then also, I would love to redo my pantry with like clear bins. So that way, you could actually see what's inside of them. I've seen some other people doing that, and I'm like, man. I wish I would have started with that, but you know, live and learn. I used to get all my stuff at the Dollar Tree, which I need to go check them out because I haven't been there for a while to see if they have any clear bins because they might have them now. Um, I don't know, so I need to go check that out. Let me know where you guys get some organization things from. My husband really wants like a place to put our spices and he saw like a really nice thing on Amazon, which I know Amazon is a good place to buy stuff sometimes. 
but you know, it's just money costly. I wish stuff wasn't so expensive. It could be you and I. Here I told you guys that I wasn't going to talk a lot in this video and I already feel like I am. <laughs> but you guys have to let me know. Do you like the chatty voiceovers? Um, I always like when other people do them because it feels like you're hanging out with a friend. And I really like that. So you guys will have to let me know down below. Or do you like just listening to music? Let me know. You guys voted on the last video. So we did country music on the last video. Um, and a lot of... Like I was shocked that a lot of you guys voted for country. Like because... I've never really asked my viewers what kind of music they like to listen to. So maybe we can do that again where I let you guys pick the music again. Maybe we can do something else because the other percentage of the voters loved like rock or pop or I forget what my other choices were. But um, so maybe we can do something different next time. But and also we could do country again if that's what you guys like to listen to. I just have a variety of people here that like different music. I myself um, am more for the music that I do normally play on my videos. Like, I always pick my music. But, um, yeah, I want to be honest with you guys. I did not grow up listening to country music. So, that's why I normally don't play that type of music. Because I'm not a big fan of country music. And that might come a shock to some people because of where I live. But I just never grew up listening to it and I don't love it. Um, there are some songs that I do like, uh, don't get me wrong. Um, but for the most part, that's just not my jam. Um, but that's okay. I know a lot. everybody's different and everybody has their own taste in music. So I thought, like I said, I, I was glad to be able to let you guys pick the music for once. Because you guys are watching my videos, so, you know wanted you guys to be able to enjoy it more to have some kind of tunes that you like to listen to so i don't even know if i mentioned really quick in the video but we're also taking down the easter decorations today i don't think i said that maybe i did see now i can't remember but yeah we're undecorating for easter which i did not have a lot of easter stuff to take down but yeah it's put away now this was on friday i think well this portion yeah this was Thursday night, and then day two will be um, Friday, I think. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, anyways, before Easter. So, it wasn't like I went really early on taking it down or anything. Um, but I was glad for it to come down. It's been up long enough. And I think this year I'm going to try to decorate for the 4th of July. I have never decorated for that holiday, to be honest with you guys. I just, I've, I've never invested in the decor for it. Um, and I'm really excited because decorating is my favorite thing to do here on my channel. All right. Mm -hmm. Would lie to you, didn't matter what I do. She's got a hold on me.
guys, it is day two now. It's Friday. Um, good Friday. The Friday before Easter. We're going to finish cleaning the house. So I got this bathroom to do the office and then Cole's bedroom. Cole's in there right now because he's on Easter break. Today was his start of Easter break. We cleaned last night. As you guys saw, my kitchen was a disaster. Um, we went to Costco yesterday and we... It just I didn't get everything put away right away when I came home so my kitchen was a wreck so I'm so happy now that the kitchen is cleaned up everything looks pretty good besides a few dishes in the sink but that's how it always is <laughs> and then all my Easter stuff we'll take down to the shed and put that away and then these little bunnies were in Cole's room um, they need fixed up a little bit Cole kind of ripped them apart and stuff I was debating on what to do with them but i think i'm just gonna put them back up in the attic and then that little cookie jar that's a rabbit needs to go up in the attic and then i'll get rid of all that stuff off the table so um yeah i'm just having a little coffee to get me going my husband had to go to work you guys have got some cleaning motivation so far in this video and we're gonna finish cleaning today carpet refresher works amazing for just like uh, a day I would say to refresh up your space it does the scent will last at least that long but I also wanted to go ahead and quickly mention this product not sponsored or anything but um, Jessica from keep calm keep calm and clean here on YouTube many of you many of you probably already follow her but she recommended um, this in one of her videos so I went to Dollar General because this is where you find this and I wanted to try it for myself. It's a room refreshener or fabric refreshener. It is good. And it's only $4 for this big bottle. So I, after I clean during the week, um, I will spray this all over the room that I'm cleaning or when I get done cleaning and it lasts like for a long time. Like I can come back into the room and still smell it after I've sprayed it like hours later. So I'm impressed with that just for the fact that a lot of air fresheners like Glade and um, what's another one? What's the other one? I can't think guys. The other one. Febreze. Those smell good when you spray them, but to me they don't last. So, but this one lasts longer in my opinion. Like you spray, I spray, I don't know, like a decent amount, not like overboard spraying it, but I got the coconut scent. And I wanted to mention it if you guys want to go try it because I really like it. So I'm going to spray this in the room when we get done. So what kind of Easter festivities do you guys do every year with your family? I would love for you to leave a comment down below and let me know. Um, I was thinking about doing a live Q&A soon. Maybe um, to let you guys ask me some questions and maybe answer them. I thought it would be fun. I have not done one of those in like years, but it's really hard for me to get people to want to ask questions because you got to have a large following for people to really want to leave questions because most of you guys know everything about me because I share a lot and I've shared a lot in the past and I appreciate you guys that have been here from a very long time ago. Um, and then I really appreciate you new followers here as well. Thank you for being here. It means a lot. Um, I'm very just, I love what I do. I love making videos. I love um, that I have the opportunity to support my family with finances by doing YouTube. And let me just tell you right now, I don't make a lot from my vlog channel and I'm so close to being able to be a YouTube partner on this channel. So I'm very excited and blessed. So thank you guys because without you all, that would not be possible. So thank you for watching my video. It means a lot. Did you guys see that flash? Yeah, that was Otis. Otis ran out of the guest room. It looked so funny as I'm watching this. He just took off running, looked like a flash. He hates when I vacuum. <laughs> He'll get up and leave and go to another room. Bless his heart. You can see his little head sticking out of the bedroom there. But yeah, he just he likes he just stays away from the vacuum at all costs. And then my cat, of course, is he hates the vacuum. He'll go and hide 
whenever I turn it on. But uh, my couch really needs a good wipe down soon. So I got a lot of other cleaning ideas coming your way that I need to get done. I need to finish doing some spring cleaning. We need to clean the windows. I mean, there's all kind of stuff, guys, that I really need to do in my house. We want to finish painting this living room. Um, we got some outdoor stuff probably in the next month or so that we want to do as well. Just a bunch of different things. So be sure to come back because we'll have more cleaning motivation your way. Um, I'm not really even sure uh, since Cole's on spring break right now, I'm not even really sure what Thursday's video is going to be um, because I have nothing pre-filmed. But we'll come up with something and we'll see what we can get into. But I'm going to go ahead and end off this video and let you guys just watch the rest. Um, I hope that you guys have gotten some motivation and have a happy Easter. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. <laughs>
guys, we have a old time desk that I'm going to bring in and we're going to switch this thing out. This thing's falling apart. It's ripping. What I might do is see if this is the one that came from the camp. If it is, we'll take it back down to the camp. So he'll have a table there. And then we have, my grandma gave us this desk that's old. It's like an old school desk, but it needs refinished. We're not going to be doing that today, but a different video will do that. But I did want to bring it in, maybe clean it um, and set it up just to see how I like it. And then we also have a chair for it. So um, yeah, that's kind of like what I want to do. We'll see. The further we move on from all those yesterdays, happiness gets nearer. The light that we see closing in so fast ahead, it's hope, it's getting clearer. The more I think of all the tough times we survived, the more it makes me smile. If nothing's broken us, you're nothing ever will Cause dreams are hard to kill Thinking about him again I know that your heart's been broken You should try and let it go And start being yourself You, you You can put on your dress We can play your favorite song And I will take care of you Go. 
Cause you don't need to be ashamed Everyone's got their hearts broken sometime Let's go out and lose our minds Forget all about him You, you
It's very old, it's solid wood. So I'm gonna clean it up a little bit. We're gonna actually, like I said, redo it. Um, but not today. And we're also gonna redo this chair. I wanna paint it, like I wanna paint the metal on it, probably black, I think. And then I need to shampoo the seat because it's a little dirty. It was a thrift shop find, so I wanna clean that really quick. Your lips on my lips, saving my life I'll be your anchor when you go down Don't you wanna, don't you wanna die Hey love, let's do our things Goosebumps over my body when we jump in channel if you guys want to see me make over this chair and the desk i don't know what i'm going to do the desk but i might try to get the chair done here soon I got over my body. 